And I want to have like this like. review Incipient as, um, I don't know, a replacement or something. So, the first cube, I don't know, the first cube isn't, like, really that bad. It gets kind of annoying once you have to just play from zero, like, when you've, like, learned all of the level. Uh, there's just, like, a few spam parts, too, in it, or, or not really spam, but I, I spammed there, like, at 6%, uh, just to make sure to do that part every time. After that, you reach a ship and a ball part. I'm just gonna group them together since they're pretty much the same. Like they have the same qualities. The um, the ball and the, uh, the ship, they're just I don't know. They're just kind of awkward, but it's not that bad. And once you've like learned the level and you're playing from zero a lot, they get really really consistent. After that, you have like the part where the lyrics start, and um, that part I don't like it. There's just so many weird and awkward timings that just. I get frustrating, like, just dying there over and over again, like, after you pass the ship ball in first cube. It's just not a good part in the level, but at, thankfully, after that, you reach a wave where it's just really fun. It just feels kind of weird once you're, like, trying to learn it, but once you have it down, it's pretty good. And right after that, you have a UFO part. Um, the UFO part isn't anything special. You rarely die there, uh, and just, I don't know, it's just calm before the storm. Then you reach the worst part in the level where you just have to spam for what feels like eternity and just it's just there's nothing to it other than just spamming and praying you like somehow buffer all the orbs. Very annoying part. And sometimes the transition doesn't even work to the ball which is complete RNG. Just some of the timings in it like half the time you can buffer them, half the time you can't buffer them. Just so annoying. For me that part, like 47 to 57 was like by far the hardest part of the level for me. Thankfully, once you like, you get dream luck and you pass that part, you get to the drop, which the drop is like actually really fun. Or the first half of the drop is pretty good. There's a few choke points, but it's not fine. It's a lot easier than the pre-drop. Then ending like the last like 10% of it, it just gets really hard again and <laughs> I somehow managed to die at 97 and 96 as new best, which <laughs> it's not that fun. So overall, the level is <laughs> the level is okay. It gets really annoying once you have bad luck, but just it's fine. It's okay. I'd say it's like a six out of ten level, probably. It's not that bad. I'd recommend it. It's pretty easy for an extreme too. It's like Accu and hypersonic difficulty for me. Anyways, um, I'm gonna go. See ya.